Hello and welcome to my to my second 3D tutorial. Today you're going to learn how to add objects in the room you'll be playing in. So basically we're just going to add the gun, the bullet and all that stuff. And it should and um yes, I forgot to say in the last one that this does require the pro edition of game maker which you can see up there game maker 7 pro yeah this is what it should turn out yes everything should look look like this so yup you will have the vase break, break all that stuff I said wouldn't be in the first video will be in this video it's pretty much just a putting some more stuff in it. Now I'm going to start with sprites. Now a new sprites you'll have to add a vase sprite so pretty much just what's going to look normally. So unbroken just still just fine fine and clean. And vase broke which can pretty much just rub out the rest of it and make it look like it's Broken. You can also do other objects that you want to shoot at, but basically we're just going to do vases. So, just for now. Now, B S P R, as in bullet sprite, but just B. So, all that is. I'm going to zoom in. It's that little dot there. That's all it is. Just a little black dot. And it'll appear much bigger in the game. Now, Gun Sprite. Which is the most difficult one. Now, people have not mentioned this, but you need an exact size to actually fit it in the room. Which really is a pain in the ass. Um, but. Yeah, you just fit it there. Yeah, just like that. Any problems, you may as well just wait till I can get a download for the game. Because it will be easier. Now, backgrounds, you don't have to add any others. Now, objects. Now, we're going to have... So, make a vase and present it with a sprite cam. So with the blue disc, pretty much, and B, you present with B sprite, and gun, you don't present with anything. I'm going to open up the vase, create, texture sprite, get texture, vase sprite. It's pretty much just that code, yeah, pretty easy. Alarm zero, execute another piece of code, which is a little bit similar, yeah. Now collision with bullet, where it, as known B, stop B, value one, operation equal two. So it should look like that, and start a block, execute a piece of code, they's broke, so that's what you should have named it, so if you didn't call it Vase bro Broke, instead of Vase Broken, just a little bit simpler for you. Now, destroy the instance other. Set alarm 0 to 120 in alarm number alarm 0. And end of a block. So, yeah. Now, in the draw, execute a piece of code. Yeah, you're gonna wanna pause and copy that now. And then, and don't forget to set the depth to minus 10. And yeah, pretty easy. Now, the bullet, which I said, yes, if nothing, no little mask pops up, I said it's a very micros kind of microscopic um, little dot. It's not microscopic, but it's pretty little, and it can't show it 
as an icon. Depth is zero, so pretty much it's just normal. Now I'm gonna create set direction and speed movement or whatever it is. Move free as known. Object cam direction at the speed of ten. Pretty easy, eh? Hey? Collision with horizontal wall. Destroy the instance self. And same with vertical. Now in draw. Execute another piece of code. Now you're going to want to copy that down by pausing the video and um, typing that down by switching. So yeah, you'll, or you'll either want to copy that from somewhere. Okay, then you're done. Run to the gun. Now this is especially depth. The depth is a very low number. Minus one thousands. I said minus, so don't forget the minus sir, uh, otherwise it won't work properly. I don't know why this is needed, but apparently it helps it to go at the very bottom. But I think it would be more helpful if you could just place it instead of having to resize your sprite all the time. If it's just a little, the little, little, um, little picture of gun, which is not as big as it wants it. Yeah, I kind of find it annoying, but you need it. So draw, execute a piece of code, DVD set projection ortho, and DVD set hidden false, draw sprite gun sprite minus 10, zero, zero. You're going to want to do what I said before. You probably want to copy that. Don't forget these are not normal brackets these are a little bit shaped out you know so it's not on the nine and zero it's on it's separate with these kind of looking brackets which I'll show you it's just it's like that but shift so yeah or you probably want to copy the code as soon as you can download like GMK file. Alright, so now what we're gonna do now is place them in the room. And this isn't any trouble at all. Now, as I was saying at my last tutorial, you saw all these little other ones, and you were like, what? It's because I'm already ahead. But just place the vases there. You can tell by going up here and I'm selecting. Now, I think you don't need to add the B sprite, I'm not sure. Keep object floor roof in the room and um, put object gun there. Place, once again, place the walls where you want it, which is what I didn't say. But if that's why it wasn't working, then you, that was why. They don't have to be joined up. You could just arrange them how you want them. Okay, now I'm going to run the game. And it should look something like that. Oh, what happened to my gun? Well, sorry about my gun, but it's gone somewhere. But Yeah. Jeez. Well, that's it. I've lost my gun. Well, not for good, but I was only showing you a tutorial. Yeah. If I got anything wrong, that was... Oh, jeez. Okay, sorry guys. It will... It should work for you, and if it doesn't, once again, send a comment and or a video response in well just below so yeah pretty simple and that's about it so thanks for watching and please subscribe